Well, I'm done cutting. Anyways, it took me exactly four hours from shooting to putting him in. Well, there he is there, and then I got bags up there in the trees, and I got him back here. I don't know well how, how well you can hear me. It's blowing up here. I had to stretch it, strip a couple layers. It, it was getting damn warm. But now it's kind of chilly, which is a good thing. Now that I got meat on the ground. But I did the uh, the gutless method for the first time. And tell you what, that worked out pretty good. I'll show you. Hold on, let me stand up. Oh. So that's where his back straps are. Looks like that there's still meat, but not much. That's his hip socket right there. Not much there. Did chop off all the legs so I don't have to pack them out. Uh, it's a good sight. Nice little buck. Look at all the damn ticks all over him. I think they're jumping, jumping ship. Try to brush them off here. Well. Yeah, I'm gonna get to packing. Got everything packed back up. I'm gonna take, I don't know, as many of these bags as I can with me. I might try to strap that bow to my backpack. It's a little day pack, so I don't know how well that's gonna work. Might have to sacrifice my uh, my mountain money. Wasn't sure if I had any in my backpack or not, but yep, I do. All right, well, there's you an update. I'm gonna take all this down to the four wheeler and grab my meat hauler and try to make it out in one pack. Well, two, I guess. So there he is, my first archery buck. All right, I'll check back in once. Once uh get back to the four-wheeler with all the loads later